Notice of this meeting has been provided to the Montclair Times, the Herald News and the Star Ledger. Um, notice has also been posted on the bulletin board in the municipal building. Great. Uh, now, Mayor, if you would call for comments from the public. Um, sorry, just do that. Mm -hmm. Can I call for comments from the public, please? Please identify yourself. Please identify yourself. My name is Gretchen Grievance. I would like to address the council on the matter of the mural on the wall on Glenridge Avenue. And I understand you've, uh, you're, you're going to make a decision very soon whether you will be sandblasting the wall to remove the mural or leave it as is, which is what the community would prefer. And what I would like to know is uh, what basis do you have for if you are to decide that you will sandblast the wall and remove the mural, which we consider a work of art. Can Thank we you, Gretchen, for your comment. <laughs> <laughs> Does anyone from the council have a comment? Um, what's the mural on? <laughs> Two women's heads, and it, it's striped, and it has the text over the stripes that says, love where you live. A very charming sentiment, don't you think? Why do you think um, the town has decided to remove the mural? Well, it's on town property, and basically, they see it as being a means of defacing town property. Or you see it as. Our, our folks don't. So. I think you have just justified our reasoning for removing it. <laughs> <laughs> well done. <laughs> yes, just keep in mind there's something called the Visual Artist Rights Act of 1990, <laughs> which may get you in a little trouble if you do decide to remove the mural. Thank you. Thank you, Gretchen. Can I just ask, thank you very much, Cindy. Um, do you have much of a problem with graffiti? Can you start it? <laughs> yes. <laughs> and, and do you know how they handle it? Is it painted over? Are the, they, they leave it. <laughs> do you ask the culprit to come and paint or do community service hours? It tends to just be left. <laughs> it's very difficult to track down everyone. Mm. So do you think it would be good to have a student task force? No. <laughs> no. Yes. <laughs> well, it is a problem here. Not, not a great problem, but a problem nevertheless. And that was actually an example of uh, something that was talked about at last night's meeting. So I really thank you all for participating.